Hey there. I'd like to talk again about the idea of rewilding, specifically rewilding the self for the wild ride of our times. And the piece I'd like to speak to is the shift in identity away from the objects of our lives, away from the kind of clothes we wear, or the car we drive, the neighborhood we live in. I'd like to speak to an identity that is deeper than our loyalties to nationality, our loyalties to any particular religious system, our loyalty to the superiority ideas of, of a species, or the color of our skin. For me, this idea of rewilding and part of the beauty of it and the gift of it in my own life has been this re-identification of the self with all of life, with the entire cosmos, in fact, so that my belonging is no longer defined by the color of my skin or the church I might go to or the car I drive or the politics. But it's deeper than that. It is rooted like this tree into the behind me, into the earth itself. And it reaches and touches the stars, the day blind stars as Wendell Berry calls them, so that I belong to the family of things. And all creatures are my relation. And their well-being is my concern. So this reshifting of identity is hinged too to the story that we tell ourselves of who we are. And this story may be grounded in fear, as it is for many of these days, and is the nature of the political climate as I speak, or if you reclaim this story, you can write a story in an identity that is rooted and grounded in love and in innate worth and in innate belonging. And then, when this heart within you opens, it is truly wild, for who knows what may change within you? Who knows what kinds of transformations are available to the human species when we come to know ourselves in this way? This is Larry Glover with Wild Resiliency Awakening. Enjoy your day and get outside in nature. Go talk to a tree or hug it. Or just give yourself love. That too is rewilding. Enjoy.